Hey, hey, everybody, welcome back to another episode of Double D's Quickie Reviews for me and you. Today, we're going to be reviewing something I got at Ross again. Cheap toys, of course, the only thing I can afford. And it is, of course, G.I. Joe's. What is this? Retro carded uh, stalker. Let's call it that. I don't know if it actually has a name. There's this file card. Roll Ranger specialty. Generals may win campaigns, but it's the sergeants who win the battles mostly by yelling and kicking butt. Yeah. Plus, he's a cool character. I love the. With my Joes, my Cobras, I love over, over flamboyant. But the Joes, I love the simplistic military design. As you can see, I paid. Three ninety nine for them, and uh, I had the original Stalker when I was a kid. I think I still have the head somewhere, but I replaced just about all the parts. You see, we get them open and take a look at them. Be careful! I, I love saving the card art from GI Joe. in here. Here's the figure. I think I have the Cobra, Com no, I don't even have the Cobra Commander in this line. Not sure what I have, but as you can see, full head articulation. His arms don't want to move, but they will. Fold out this thing. Elbow. Swivel at the elbow. And the hand turns. He has an app crunch, which is kind of blocked by this vest thing. Man, it's kind of dim in here. Is that just my eyes? Anyways, his knee bends, and he has foot and ankle articulation. And, of course, bends at the shin. All in all, it looks like stock of should. And he has a holster here for his handgun. I think that's a holster. Yep. Uh, let's see. Is there one for the knife? I don't see one for the knife. That's kind of weird. Anyways, the accessories comes with is a well, two machine guns, a base, a handgun, and a knife. Pretty good looking accessories. Very basic, but still pretty good looking. The base has what's his name on it. He's Sergeant Stalker. I don't know if Hasbro lost the name rights or what. Let's see how well he fits on that. Okay, he fits pretty good on the base. There he is. I love that color scheme. The camos. The nod to the original Joes with the um, well, I don't know, the sort of like scrunchy type sleeve ends. Looks almost like he's got the upper body of, oh, what's that, Joe? Who's that, Joe? Um, Beachhead. But all in all, kick-ass figure. If you're a fan of the old Joes, I do recommend this. I like the old looks. There we go. Dang it. Okay, I can't get that foot to... What am I missing here? Sorry about that. There you go. As I said, I love the retro look. I think they should release some classifieds with this sort of look instead of trying to pizzazz them all. Maybe at a lower price point. For those of us who can't afford the current price points. But still, cool. Now that was a rather quick video. So I do have a small little supplemental in here. Oh, first of all, I do recommend him if you like Stalker. But I also have for my 
as you all know, I collect only certain types of Hot Wheels. Batmobiles. Oh yeah. Got me three new Batmobiles. Now normally I don't buy variants, but yeah. I got the oh, I've already opened it. Three of five. Help oh, Batman spy yeah, whatever. Anyways. first one based on the 1989 you know, it's one of the few that I buy every version I see because that is my Batman Ooh, and it rides so sweet and another version of that the white car I don't know why that's okay Ooh. compare the two you can see there they are the same car just different color schemes course the third one I don't know what it's from wait Batman the brave and the bold okay that's the Batmobile from Batman the brave and the bold a different scheme boom gold I saw a white version was it white I can't remember what color it was of another Batmobile today at work, but I didn't pick it up. Not my thing. Anyways, there they are. I want to. Pretty cool. I can't wait to add them next spring. Oh, God. I got to wait till next spring to add these to the other. Someday I'll do a video with just all my Batmobiles. Someday. But I want to thank you all for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. And what do you think? What's something that you buy different versions of whenever you see it? For me, as you can see, it's the Batmobiles. And um, who's your favorite original? Joe. Let me know. Yo, Joe. And with that, Double D. Oops. Out.